What's up guys, welcome back to another YouTube video and in this video I'm going to show you how to control the frames per second or FPS in Pygame. So let's begin. But before we get started, I'd like to tell you about a little something called the Rift. So the Rift is an academic Discord server that provides free help in various subjects including SAT, ACT, AP, and college help. The server offers many features like one-on-one -on -one help and live streams, resources, and much, much more. The server also has other features that allow students to let loose and just enjoy themselves, including chats and sports lounges and a gaming area so you can talk and play with the fellow members of the server at any time. So if you're interested, please make sure to join the Rift. The link is in the description below. And now, without further ado, let's get on with the video. All right, so let's just start with our usual routine with Pygame. So import Pygame. So we imported Pygame and now let's create our window and this is what all of our drawings and images go on. So I'll just call this screen and I'll set it equal to pygame.display.set underscore mode. And I now pass in a tuple uh, with the dimensions of this window. So I'll just say a thousand pixels by 500 pixels. And now let's um, go to our main game loop since for this there really isn't any setup needed besides this. So I'm just going to create um, our boolean variable. So I'll call this running and I'll set it equal to true. And after this I'll do while running for event in pygame.event.get. if event dot type equals equals so if the events type is pygame dot quit then set running to false and outside the while loop I'll just do pygame dot quit okay so now under screen I'll create a variable I'll call this f fps in all caps and I'll set it equal to 60 and since it's in all caps it basically means it's a constant and this variable won't be changed. Alright so I'll just set it to 60 since that's a pretty decent uh, frame rate to run on and it's gonna work on most likely all computers so and that's the reason for FPS because some things might run faster on my computer than on your computer or vice versa. So having this FPS really just makes it a lot easier and uniform. All right, so next underneath while running, I'll do clock equals pygame.time.clock and put the parentheses over there. And actually this should be outside the while loop, my bad. So outside the while loop, just before running, I'll do clock equals pygame.time.clock. And now b below the while loop, I'll just do clock.tick FPS. So basically what, what this does is it just runs it at 60 FPS. So it runs it initializes clock and while running the clock has to tick first and then this for loop and everything inside of it runs and after that the clock ticks and then it just keeps on going and this is what helps it create more of a uniform fps and there isn't really much to run here basically it's just you know you can do whatever you want there's nothing that's going to show up on the screen. FPS it just kind of works. Uh, this just works in the background. And it just makes sure that your program is going to be uniform and work across all devices. 
all right thanks for watching guys don't forget to like and subscribe and shout out to rift uh please join that discord the link will be in the description below and i'll catch you next time peace